I I wasn't close to my dad until I found out all the struggles of like that he had to live through. This one time at the dinner table, he mentioned in Mexico, he used to work on this farm day and night after school. He tried really hard for his studies, but he always like ended up going back to the farm. He said he really wanted to help his parents out. And that's when like my eyes kind of opened. It was really nice because I finally found this like person that I could always come to and talk to and he turned into like my number one fan. He's kind of like, I wouldn't say perfect, but to me he's perfect. Does he know you're writing about him? It's kind of like his birthday gift. I'm trying to keep it as low key to him, so. So you're trying to keep it a secret? Yeah. Okay, my name is Allison, I'm in the seventh grade, and the title of my poem is The World to Me. This poem is dedicated to my father. Gracias por ser el mejor papá del mundo. For nine, oh wait, hold on, I forgot. Okay, for 19 years, papá lived in Puebla on the farms near his home. They grew apples and avocados, corn and guacamole. And then he made his way to America where he got a job at a supermarket. For 20 years, he has stocked the shelves on the Third Avenue Garden on the Upper East Side. 20 years. He is a very organized person. He likes everything in its place. Thanks to him, our home is always as tidy as a grocery store in the mornings. In the stockroom, there's a giant fan that whirs so loudly all day long. Four years ago, he had surgery to stop the constant ringing in his ears. So much of the produce that he puts in place wears a sticker that says grown in Mexico. These apples, these avocados, they cross the border just like he did. And now they have to fit in, get in line, just like he does. My papa means the world to me. The world, el mundo. I get my positivity from him. We both smile with our whole mouths and teeth. We can both walk into any boring party and make it bright. He bring order to the shelves but joy to the aisles. When something exciting comes into the store, he brings it home for us to try. Dragon fruit and passion fruit, white strawberries and spicy mango lollipops, mazapans and beans that are a dark denim blue. But I don't care what's in his bag. I just care that he is home, that he is healthy, and that we can have dinner together. Wow. 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 And I really hope people try to make connections with their parents and like spend more time with them because they brought you here and I think they should really appreciate them.